Hello and welcome to you all to Stamford Bridge, the home of Chelsea Football Club on a lovely day in southwest London. Martin Tyler here, along with the former England international Alan Smith. Premier League football we have for you, it's coming right up. It's Chelsea and they take on Crystal Palace. I love visiting this ground, rarely been disappointed with the entertainment on offer. Don't think I will be today either. Jorginho, number 17. Well, there are players here who stand out a bit. These two in particular, I think, today, Alan. I love watching this pair play. They haven't disappointed this season. They've been the most threatening players for me, for both their teams. Here's the Chelsea lineup. In goal, Kepa Arisa Balaga. Marcus Alonso starts looking to continue his good form at the back. And just one up front for them today. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Enjoy the night. What we've got here, Alan, is a side that don't concede many goals. And Perhaps they don't score enough, that's down to the overall philosophy of the coach. Yeah, they don't uh, commit too many men forward. They work incredibly hard, I know, on the training ground in the week, on organisation, who's where at any given time, and it does work. Pulisic. Marcos Alonso. Here's Jorginho. Mateo Kovacic. Now Willian. The space is on the inside. Kelly. Defender's done well here to clear the danger. That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Lovely, incisive pass. Looking for teammates in the middle. Really vital interception here. This might be dangerous from the corner. In from William. It looked a certain goal until the defender managed to get some contact. That's just instinct, but that is top defended. Here's Jorginho. Has a go here. Threw everything behind that shot and frustrated that it wasn't quite on target. Well, if he keeps getting in those kind of areas, I'm sure he'll score pretty soon. Kovacic. Here's Willian. Tammy Abraham. Aspilicueta. He could cross it now. Now Willian. Aspilicueta. Return to Willian. Jorginho. Drilled it into the middle. Abraham, he's won possession. Oh, they've lost the ball. Now Jorginho. Kovacic. To put them in front, and Chelsea put it into the net.
Well, that's a poacher's goal. Maybe not his most spectacular, but an important one here. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Well, it's been tight before that goal, but now the manager, he's so pleased because I reckon he feels his team can go on and win this. Chelsea have the lead. Joel Ward. He could take them on here. An attack that wasn't quite that in the end. Now Jorginho. Here's Willian. Tammy Abraham. That's Filiqueta. Abraham. And that's given away possession. Great place to win it back. Kovacic. Keeper controls it, never looked like bouncing off him. Yeah, it made it look easy, but his positioning did that for him. Chelsea in front, Alan, would you say they're in control? No, I wouldn't say that, but certainly they've got their noses ahead, they'll take it. That's Filiqueta. Still on the lookout for that chance to open up the opposition. Well, he's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception, made it look easy, actually. That was a foul. The referee's allowed the game to go on. He's entitled to do that. Looking to attack the cross in numbers. Well, the goalkeeper will hope that it stays like that throughout the game. That's cut out. Got his body in front of the opponent and protected the ball well. An incisive pass. Look the goalkeeper in the eye. Got to finish here. Well, he's in the clear, and the goalkeeper has saved it and saved his side. Well, his defenders should be thanking him because they left him exposed, didn't they? But he answered the call. Well, he's going to show the yellow card. That's good refereeing to go back to the original offence, having played the advantage. Yeah, you always felt that he would. It wasn't the best of challenges, that. Zaha! Offside given, Allen. Oh, I'm not sure he's got that one right, you know. I think he was on. Half time at 1 0. And the referee has blown, and the second half is now in progress. Sheku Kuyate. Now, can they make this count? Keeping the ball well in a dangerous area now. One of their better passers, and he's given it away here. To bring them level. Turned aside there by the keeper. swung in Tammy Abraham Mateo Kovacic that's Filiqueta I would guess in this possession play here they're trying to get the opposition to come out and harry them and maybe bend past their way through them well sitting back it's a bit of a policy here and letting the opposition come at them, risky. Could get the ball into the box now. And the referee blows his whistle, the flag was up for offside. Well, they're still trailing and they need to do something now if they want to get back into this game. Maybe some fresh legs will do the trick. Maximilian Meyer.
Pulisic. Abraham. And it's been an hour of very good football here. We've still got 30 more minutes to go, and I'm sure we're going to enjoy that as well. The defender really putting his body on the line to stop the cross. Substitution for Crystal Palace. Well, now they're behind. They've got to try and switch things around. And here comes a substitution. Number 10, Andres Townsend. Here's Willian. Well, the team unable to find the pass there. They ran into a strong challenge, to be fair. Milivojevic. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Marcos Alonso. Chelsea have the ball in the wide area. Important touch from the defender there. Now Jorginho, Mateo Kovacic. Oh, great chance! And the keeper doing his job. Pulisic, Mateo Kovacic. Conte. Now with Marcus Alonso stopping the cross. Important job for the defender. A real opportunity for Chelsea to get the win now. But they just need to hold their nerve in these closing minutes. All about game management, isn't it? They've got the players to see it through, I think. Kovacic. Well, he's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception. Made it look easy, actually. Jordan Ayew. Townsend. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Very good Chelsea today, and good value for a victory that they should now get. Well, the clock's showing and nine minutes left to play. It's going to go right to the wire here with this one-goal lead. And the supporters, well, they've upped their game, there's no question about that. Just listen to them. Yeah, they've been brilliant, but it's been a close game, and you wouldn't put it past the visitors to, to nick a goal back. Andros Townsend. Went in quickly there, could be a throw. And the managers decided for a change of personnel. Coming onto the pitch, number 17, Christian Benteke. Cahill, Patrick Van Arnholt, Cahill. Appreciation for today's man of the match. Meyer. Number 17, Matthew Joel Kovacic. Ward. Pressing forward with an equaliser in mind. He came on strong in that period of attacking play. In the end, it was disappointing. Added time coming up. There'll be two minutes of it. He's got some room out there. Saw a gap to cross it into low. Didn't allow the cross to come in. The defender did well. Intercepted here. Well, here's a chance. They've got a penalty. Oh, what a gift. I mean, he had to make the tackle because he was going to score, I think. Penalty given but no extra punishment for the culprit. Yeah, I think that's fair enough. I mean, it was a foul, but uh, he's not denied an obvious goal-scoring opportunity there. That's hit the bar, and it's still in play. Good clearance. It's finished here. They kept right on to the end of the road, and a happy ending. Not much to split the two sides, but I think the winning team just about deserved it. I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Really good assist for that winning goal, and he's capable of that, really sees the pass early.